Hey film fans, it's Jess coming at you today with another Dollar Tree haul. I uh, picked up quite a few titles at Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, so let's go ahead and get started. First up, one for the kiddos. We've got uh, Sesame Street's Arts and Crafts Playdate. Next we've got uh, James Caan and Little Moon, Judd McGraw, including a four bonus pack movies, uh, Pony Express Rider, Deadly Companions, Fort Yuma Gold, and My Outlaw Brother. Next up we've got The People vs. George Lucas. Thought that would be pretty interesting. Next we've got the John Wayne McClintock collection. It's also with 10 bonus movies. Sagebrush Trail, Randy Rides Alone, Rides, Rider of Destiny, The, the, the Desert Trail, Helltown, Winds of the Wasteland, Rage of the Dawn, Fighting Westerners, Abilene Town, and To the Last Man. Next we've got uh, the three movie collection of Prom Night 1, 2, and 4. Happy to get this in the collection. Especially for a dollar. Next we've got uh, a film, don't know anything about it, but looked really interesting, called Domain. It does come with a, a slippy cover. Next up, we've got a uh, newer version of Chris O'Dowd and Ray Romano in Get Shorty. It's the complete first season. This is, I thought, pretty good find. Next up, I was finding these in a, in a two pack, but I did find the Robert the Doll triple feature pack with Robert. Uh, the Curse of Robert and the Toy Maker. Next, we've got another horror film set called The Demon Hole, Sam Hain. It also comes with Beneath the Mississippi and Legacy of Evil. Next up, another John Wayne set. It's uh, John Wayne, uh, the Great American Legend. Has uh, Randy Rides Alone, the Star Packer, Lucky Texan, Blue Steel, Lawless Frontier, Neath the Arizona Sky, the Dawn Riders. Over six hours. Actually bulked up my Western collection during this haul. I had quite a few. Now on for some, some Blu-rays. It's the Blu-ray DVD combo. <clears throat> Dean Kane and Kill Katie Malone. Thought this one really looked interesting. I love the cover art. Thought it was uh, really looked good. Next up, uh, Ninja and Ninja 2. I actually thought Ninja was pretty good. I have it on DVD, or I'm sorry, on Blu-ray, but it's all a combo pack, so I, I picked it up. Next, we've got uh, a Blu-ray DVD combo pack of Frenzy. The other one I thought looked really interesting. Next, we've got a uh, season one of the Being Human. That's the the British version. 
I actually enjoyed this a lot more. I like the American version. This one comes with a slip cover. Or slip box, I guess it is. But fun, fun series. I really enjoyed that. Next for the, the kiddos again, we've got a Blu-ray DVD, Monster High, Greatest Great Scarier Reef. I try to pick up a few movies for the kiddos when I can. Uh, always good to keep them busy. Another Blu-ray DVD, Monster High, Electrified. At least this way maybe I'll get them into the, the horror genre a little bit. Next we've got uh, a Blu-ray of The Adventures of Merlin. And this is Season 5. It's a three disc set. Sorry about that. Next up, we've got uh, Beyond Skyline. These I actually picked up about a, a few days ago. Uh, my wonderful niece told me about uh, a sale they were having, so I went up there to her store and picked them up. And uh, last from that store was a Blu-ray DVD digital of RoboCop. thought I had this in the collection, but apparently I did not. So I uh, I went ahead and picked it up on Blu-ray. So that's it from that store. And uh, let's go ahead and see what we picked up from the other stores. We've got uh, a DVD of Urban Cowboy, or Urban Country, I'm sorry. Brad Pitt, Morgan Freeman, and Seven. Really look forward to watching this again. I thought it was really good. Incident in Ghostland. True evil never dies. That one also comes with a slipcover. I heard this was really good. I know nothing about it. Steve Carell, Steve Buscemi, Alan Arkin, Jim Carrey, the incredible Burt Wonderstone. Heard a lot of people talking about it, so fair to pick it up. Next, we got the four movie collection of Steven Seagal, Driven to Kill, Kill Switch, uh, Mercenary for Justice, and Today You Die. You can see most of these were listed at five bucks from somewhere, but I'd say I picked them up for a dollar. Thought this looked pretty good. This is Christina Ricci and John Cusack and Distorted. This also comes with slipcover. A best of Saturday Night Live with David Spade. starting to pick up these when I see them. Um, I know I probably won't get the whole collection of uh, Saturday Night Live, but I fear I'll pick up the individual ones when I can. Uh, here's a 10 movie pack of high octane films. I'll let you stop moving the uh, video and take a look at the titles if you'd like. I don't want to repeat them all. Look like some good ones on there though. Next up we've got Midnight Horror Collection of the Devil's Partner, Black Dragons, Monstrosity, and uh, Night of the Blood Beast. Some fun films.
this one is uh sorry how you say it, I guess Jewtopia Jewtopia had some interesting people in it so the only reason I picked it up next we've got uh, Red Island A great find I thought was uh, the invasion of the body snatchers and uh, just the newer version with Donald Salo and Brooke Adams and Leonard Nimoy also had uh, I think it was Angela Cartwright or was it Veronica Cartwright Veronica Cartwright I'm sorry Next we've got uh, The Battle Begins, Viking Blood. I like some of these, these kind of films, they're normally pretty interesting. This one does come with the, the slippy cover. Next up, inspired by a true story, Devil's Whisper. Faith is not enough. Okay, the next store brought me a small haul. Uh, it's a four film western pack again. Uh, Death Rides a Horse, Gun in the Pulpit, Kid Vengeance, and Vengeance Valley. Mostly spaghetti, spaghetti westerns, but look like fun ones. Thought this looked pretty interesting. This last Heroes of D Day, a BBC thing. This also in a in a slip cover. Next up we've got Fear Incorporated. I saw the light with Tom Heddleson. Elizabeth Olsen. Story of Hank Williams. Thought it'd be an interesting docudrama kind of thing. And uh, we also picked up a Blu-ray, The Deadlands. And then a combination, this is going to be a combination of uh, a few other Dollar Trees that I stopped at. Oh, there's quite a few of them here, so uh, we've got the seven movie bonus movies of Croczilla. Japan was just the appetizer. Mostly older films, but I like most of those that's, that are on there. Next, we've got the Midnight Horror Collection again, A Curse of the Wolf. Uh, the Vampire Conspiracy, Bachelor Party in a Bungalow of the Damned, and Fist of the Vampire. Always good to bulk up the, the horror films. Next up we've got uh, the minute, Demented Mind Behind Puppet Master. It's dangerous worry dolls, demonic toys, and doll graveyard. Just the kind of film you want to show all the little girls in the family, right? Next, we've got another western. It's uh, Wild Gritty Westerns. It's uh, some dollars for the Django, Revenge of Trinity, Pony Express Riders, and Bounty Killer. Another uh, spaghetti western, I think. Next up, we've got Holiday. Surviving them as hell, and that the truth. Next, we've got Back to the Future, the animated series Dickens of Christmas. I've never seen these, but pick it up for a buck. 
Next we've got Jim Carrey in a double feature of Ace Ventura, Pet Detective, and When Nature Calls. Both films for a buck. I actually like these to a degree. They're just dumb comedy kind of thing that find waste of a few hours. Next we picked up, um, I thought this was kind of nice. It's a, like a booklet thing of six DVDs, The American Vietnam War. America's Vietnam War. 50th Anniversary Collector's Edition. Uh, it's really quite heavy. It's got a booklet and a book in it, like say six DVDs, and uh, looked pretty interesting. Next, they've got a holiday collection, the five film collector set, plus bonus 20 holiday songs. we got Old Little Town of Bethlehem, Don't Forget the Baby Jesus, The Christmas Tree, Dear Santa, and The First Christmas. Next up, we're running low, so uh, this was actually a uh, sealed together two two disc or uh, two box sets. This is TV westerns. And I will fight no more forever. Also with Aces of Eights, Rebellion, Hit Saddle and One Eyed Jacks. Uh, but both those and the T V classics was uh both for a buck together. Next up we've got a three DVD set of Heroes of World War II. I don't watch a lot of these type of documentaries, but uh, I do sit down and watch, watch them now and then. Next up we've got uh, a DVD with digital code coming in its slippy cover of High Voltage. Thought that looked pretty interesting. Next we've got a BBC video of the Devil's D Disciple with Patrick Stewart. And last one up is based on a true life murder which inspired the Strangers, Cabin 28. So that's it for this Dollar Tree haul. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'm sorry it took so long. There was quite a few of them to show. But I uh, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Please like, share, and subscribe. And click that bell for future, future notifications. I would appreciate it. And um, please leave a comment. And uh, let me know if you've seen any of these films. And what you think of them. And uh, we will catch you very soon. Keep watching those movies. Thanks for watching.